All right, hello everybody. My name is David. We're gonna go over some tips to boost your cycling experience right here in Boston. Now, I've been cycling quite a bit in Boston, and a lot of this is based on my observations, what things I've seen, experienced myself, mistakes made by me and others, uh, just to boost that experience, make it overall better for you. So we're gonna go over five things here. First thing is the helmet. All right, you may not wanna wear one, whatever, style, all that. This is gonna boost your experience. What I see is about, honestly, I'd say 60% of the riders, including scooters and everything, do have a helmet, leaving about 40% without. That's just kind of like my quick math. So helmet, number one, you'll feel safe, you'll have a better ride. Number two, tires. Regardless of whatever kind of bike you have, you will encounter a lot of divots out here riding. You will, it's gonna happen. It's, there's no doubt about it. So. The type of tire you have, it, make sure you're confident in that. I like these, they're thicker. Uh, they can handle those divots and then make sure it's properly maintained, pumped up and all of that. That will ruin a ride if you get out there and your tires are giving you a problem. So we've got helmet, uh, we've got tires, and next is safe zone. So right here, you're inside safe zone two. Boston Bike has designated some safe zones. There's uh, <clears throat> gonna be uh, at least five uh, larger ones, bigger ones where you can roam around, have some fun. You can tell in here, you could be in here with kids and kind of bike around. And there's more to the safe zone as well. So look on the channel, the posts, uh, the data posts um, and videos where I talk about uh, the safe zones, where they're at. And we're also talking about how to get in and out of them. A lot more will follow on that. So we got helmet, tires, safe zone, intersections. Here's one right here. This is not, may not seem like that big of a deal, uh, but I see a lot of close calls here. And then there's a lot more severe ones with a variety of different traffic signals. So even inside a safe zone, there might be a intersection you need to be very careful with. And through, all throughout the city, there's a lot of intersections with different traffic signals, different maintenance conditions, just my tip is just take it easy. Look, the light's gonna change in your favor eventually. Your best bet is to follow the traffic signals, take a deep breath and relax. All right, so helmet, tires, safe zone, intersections, and then routes. Boston Bike has created several routes so far. We got a lot more coming. And what we're trying to do with that is to point you in the right direction to get you in and out of somewhere or to a certain place or back from a place easily without a lot of confusion so again look for those on the channel for actual routes we'll say in the title or in the description that it's an actual route meaning done it multiple times and tested it out to see if it's an efficient way to kind of get around so hopefully that helps you